Hello and welcome back to the We Are City channel, episode 13 of season 2 of the FIFA 21 career mode. Here with Manchester City with Julian Nilesman in charge. As you can see there, anticipation builds before the UEFA Champions League. Big match between FC Bayern and Manchester City. So our quarter-final game, first leg in the Champions League, will be against Bayern Munich. Nagelsmann returns back to Germany. We'll have a look who the other quarterfinals are, in fact. See which other sides are playing. And you see Paris Saint-Germain. They play into Milan and currently 2-1 up already. So they've already played their first leg. Liverpool against Juventus. Liverpool lead 2-0 as well over Juventus in the first leg. Bayern versus City, which we know. And Real Madrid versus Atletico Madrid. And I'm hoping to avoid Atletico Madrid after they embarrassed us last season. Although it's a different team most of the time. Most of the players, really. And a different manager as well. So things are going to be different. We're going to get straight into this first leg against Bayern Munich and see which side we can play and which players are fit for today's game. So this is the side we're going to have to go with against Bayern Munich. Plenty of tired legs, plenty of players that have got absolutely no match sharpness at the moment for whatever reason. Probably because we haven't been doing training because we're trying to, you know, improve the fitness of the players to make them 100 or at least fit for games. And now they're fit, but now they've got no match sharpness. So that's, we need to find a middle ground, don't we, in training. Training's quite a difficult thing this year. But this is the side we're going to go with. Edison starts in goal. Now this is a very odd looking lineup. You're going to have to bear with me really and try and understand it best you can. Even I don't understand it, but we're playing what we have got. We haven't got any right backs at all really fit enough to start. So it's Tagliafico at left back. Ake Diaz, enough Meccano was sort of a, a right back, a right centre back. Mahrez is playing high and wide on the right. So him and Tagliafico pretty much holding the flank. So it is still the sort of five that we usually play. The three at the back and the two wing backs. We've got Zakari and Benesur holding down the midfield together. A more defensive midfield. Torres on the left. Bowden through the middle and Gabriel Jesus up top. On the bench we've got Harlan Braff, Bernardo Silva, Obi Ajaria, Kyle Walker and Rodri. You can see Cancelo, Mendy, De Bruyne. I think I'd rather have De Bruyne. An unfit Kevin De Bruyne on the bench over Bernardo Silva. Sterling, Laporte. I mean, Kangin Lee hasn't been involved either today. And of course we know Jack Grealish is injured. So that's the side we're going to go with. It's the best we're going to put out there today. Uh, given the fitness situation, the sharpness situation, the sharpness is down of all the squad. So that needs to be improved on. But um, we're going with the defensive side and hopefully we can try and conserve ourselves for the second leg. Get a draw here in Germany, in Munich and come back and then finish them off hopefully in the second leg. So there is the Bayern Munich side warming up. Here at the Allianz Arena, Serge Gnabry, a danger man for them today. Leroy Sané of course as well playing against his old club if he's on the field today for Bayern Munich which I expect him to be. And Riyad Mahrez is playing a big role towards the end of the season here. As you can see there, the other quarterfinals, PSG and Inter, Liverpool and Juventus, Atletico and Real Madrid. So if we were to win this game, we will play Atletico Madrid in the semi-final once again, which I'm not looking forward to. So two sides ready. We'll have a look at the Bayern Munich side and see who are they playing. And Manchester City versus Bayern Munich. Lewandowski up top for them and it's live from the Allianz Arena. So just a quick look at the Bayern Munich side, who they are playing, because he didn't come up with the teams for whatever reason. They've gone with Manuel Neuer in goal. A back four, a strange back four. Davis, a very attacking left back, but then they've gone with Diego Carlos and Sergio Busquets. So one very good player on this game, Diego Carlos. Sergio Busquets playing in defence, which is odd. Nicolas Sewell is at right back rather than at centre back. Then they've gone with Kimmich and John Henderson. That's a strange sign, and he is captain John Henderson in the middle. Gnabry, an ex Manchester City, Sane on the left, and a Muller. In behind Robert Lewandowski, a dangerous side. And uh, Lewandowski is going to cause us problems if we give him space. Leroy Sané as well on the wing. The same with Sergio Gnabry. Could cause some problems for us today. And defensively, they're very strong as well. Sula. Good ball over the top to Gnabry. Gnabry with a cross. Oh, it falls to Lewandowski. And we're 1-0 down. And we're here to try and keep it tight. And get a clean sheet. And that's not a good start, is it? 1-0 down to Bayern Munich straight away. It's Robert Lewandowski with the goal. We'll see here. The cross comes in from Gnabry. Deflects off Ake. Some finish by Lewandowski. Some finish, isn't it? By probably the best striker in the world at the moment. We've got Haaland on the bench. Jesus in there today. Haaland not quite fit enough to start. But uh, it looks like it's going to be a game for Haaland. With their first shot on target. Their first shot of the game. For both sides, Bayern Munich lead 1-0. Bowden looking for a pass. Oh, he finds Mares. Mares into Jesus and Manuel Neuer catches it. Positive signs though, early on. Diaz up. 
Not that I was hoping Lewandowski was injured, but I was hoping he wouldn't get up so quickly from that. Zakaria switches it out to Riyad Mahrez. It's up against Alfonso Davis today. Bowden. Oh, into Jesus. Jesus! Oh, and he's hit it straight at Manuel Neuer. Just hasn't been the player he was last season, Gabriel Jesus. That injury seems to have ruined him. Ferran. Oh, brilliant by Ferran. Back to Foden. Oh, it's blocked. Carlos clears away. Nabry. Oh, Benesir flew in. Lewandowski. Good tackle by Ake and Benesir tidies up. And Diaz backed up Meccano. Oh, into Diaz. Dangerous is playing out from the back. It's worked. Davies. Sane. Oh, Meccano's lost him. Diaz has got to get across. Look how quick Alfonso Davis is. Oh, that is a lucky again. 2 0 down. Lewandowski. Wasn't that a lucky deflection there? I'd say again. Davis crossed into Lewandowski. He's tried to take a touch on his chest. And he just hits him. Fires perfectly to Gnabry. What a volley again. Two wonderful finishes for Bayern Munich goals. What a finish by Serge Gnabry. 2 0 down we are to Bayern Munich. Today's plans have definitely not gone to plan, haven't they? We're in danger of going out. Or looking like we've gone out after the first leg. Ferran. Good little spin. Good little chop inside as well. Single handedly taken on by Munich here for Antares. Single handedly taken on by Munich. And then he plays in Jesus. Who can't get on the end of it. Maybe he should have gone on his own for Ram there. Carlos has done it then. Mares. Jesus. Timed his run. Oh, good little chop inside. Jesus. Close to the near post. It's a save by Manuel Neuer. Going to be a tough keeper to beat. Probably the, be the best keeper in the world, Manuel Neuer. And he's in there again. No City players even going to press this. And win it back from Nabry. Tagliafico does finally. Sula. Henderson, what a ball. Nabry. He's onside. Serge Nabry's onside here. Off Meccano. I think that's sliding in. Just sort of put him off. They've won a corner in eighth and Ake. Back defending. If you remember in the semi-final last season, Ake was at fault for not back defending them situations. He's done it there today though. Bowden. This is a really poor start. Zakaria. He's got Diego Carlos on him. He's got to be careful. Zakaria. Oh, into Jesus. Davis is on him. Oh, he's so quick, Alfonso Davis. Jesus! Oh, and he's put it wide. His finishing just isn't good enough, Gabriel Jesus, this season. Should be scoring there. Benesir. Mares. Davis all over him. Zakaria. Ferran. Oh, it's gone to Jesus. Tagliafico's in. Tagliafico on his right foot and he's put it wide. Another chance missed. He's away from Carlos. Mares. Ferran's continued his run. Oh, good cross by Ferran and it's blocked. And we won't get the corner, I don't think. Because it is half time and 2 0 down we are at the Allianz Arena. And 2 0 down in this quarter final first leg to Bayern Munich. A slow day at the office of Ferran Torres. He's probably been our most exciting player as well. The well, second half underway. No change at half time. We've stuck with what we've got, even though we are 2 0 down. I mean, put it this way if we get knocked out, at least we don't have to face Atletico again. We were unreal last time, but. Pep Guardiola was sat due to his failures in the Champions League as well as the Premier League that, that has to be said but we need to be doing better in the Champions League Mares, Foden Foden good ball Ferran from a tight angle saved by Neuer Ferran again and it's Sula away oh and I've just took Ferran off by mistake I think can I reverse that change I can't. I've taken Ferran Torres off by mistake. Well, we're going to bring De Bruyne on. Mistake taking Ferran Torres off. We didn't mean to do it. Had a chance here, Ferran. Nearly beat Manuel Neuer. 
So off comes Ferran and Zakaria, and on comes Kevin De Bruyne and Obi Ajaria. Mars with a cross in to Jesus. Naya punches it away. So hoping a City player would be quicker to that. Busquets. Well played, Ajaria. Well played. De Bruyne. Ajaria. Into Jesus. Oh, he nearly played it in. Oh, De Bruyne has won it off Davis. Jesus. Mares. Oh, that is some finish by Riyad Mares. I don't know how he's beat Neuer from there like that, but he's done it. And Mares is hitting form just when we need it. Like we said, towards the end of the season. Since January, he's really started to play like the old Riyad Mares. Ball into him by Jesus. And oh, that is some finish by Mares. The arrogance, really. To clip it past Neuer like that. I don't know how Neuer's been beaten so easily by Riyad Mahrez's shot. Nagelsmann celebrates 2 1. An away goal as well. That's important. Pretty much counts as 2. Back in this game. Bayern Munich 2, Manchester City 1. De Bruyne again. Mahrez. De Bruyne. Oh, into Jesus. Gabriel Jesus makes it 2 all. Well, what a difference Kevin De Bruyne has made. He's come on, played two passes that have unlocked this Bayern Munich defence. And he's even let Jesus score as well now. Jesus on the end of the Kevin De Bruyne pass. What a difference Kevin De Bruyne has made. De Bruyne here picks it up. Outside the boot past the Jesus. First time finish on his left foot across the goalkeeper, Manuel Neuer. Who I think probably should have been doing better a player of his uh, quality, a goalkeeper of his quality. Here's some finish by Jesus though, isn't it? Is Jesus back as well? Well, just as soon as that, as quick as that. Manchester City 2, Bayern Munich 2, and we're right back in this tie. You can see the running in Avery. And you've got Sane running on this side as well. Up against up Meccano. Sane, Kimmich. Kimmich! Oh, it's a good save by Edison. He's offside, Joshua Kimmich. Trying to block that pass off to him. Good tackle, Ruben Diaz. Big tackle on Leroy Sane. I think we will bring Jaden Braff on. I would like a bit of pace on that left-hand side. We have got Holland as well, of course, but I think we'll keep Jesus on and bring Jaden Braff on. Holland's going to be rested because we're going to need him in the second leg. Foden off, Braff on. Got Diaz on him. Diaz, what a win! Mares into Jesus. Jesus into Braff and Jaden Braff, who's going to get a yellow card for his celebrations because of the tackle on Nabry. 17 years old and he has scored against Bayern Munich in a quarter final. Is he 18 now? 19 maybe. He's come through the youth system. Initially signed from PSV some years ago at about 15 years of age. And what a superstar he is. Brilliant goal from Jaden Braff. And a confident little celebration from him once again. Four goals in the Champions League this season for this young man. And he's been absolutely incredible this season. And he knows he needs more game time next season. We need to make room for him. Like we said, this squad is massive. And we need to have a look at the squad. I know that we've got players like Mares and Bernardo Silva and Sterling. All these players that can play in the wing positions. Jack Grealish, Foden, Braff there as well. And Braff has been incredible. And we don't want to lose a talent like Jaden Braff. Muller again. Over the top to Serge Nabry. Good tackle, Diaz. That is a perfect tackle by Ruben Diaz. Gets his foot on the ball. Nabry's fallen over. He's won himself a free kick. Muller's off now. Joshua Zerke's on. Strange one. You think they bring a more experienced player, but we don't need on the bench. Diaz away. And he's far as Henderson. Lewandowski. Well, Lewandowski out there is fine by me because he's not in the box. Braff wins it. Benesur. De Bruyne. Oh, they're in trouble here, Bayern Munich. They're in trouble. Because here is Braff. Busquets not got the pace. Braff! Oh, what a goal by Jaden Braff. That is incredible. Absolutely incredible from Jaden Braff. Manchester City 4, Bayern Munich 2. Well, we're 2-0 down. And we're thinking this is without the Champions League. 
but Jaden Braff has come on off the bench, the youngster, and look at this. Brilliant little skill, in, skill inside, but gets there. Pulls it. Looks like he went through his legs, possibly. And then a little cutback on the shot as well. Pass Manuel Neuer. One of the best young players in the world, and Julian Nagelsmann is getting the best out of him at the moment. 85 minutes gone. That's his fifth goal in the Champions League this season. And our fourth of the night. And we lead Bayern Munich by four goals to two. They're pushing forward by him because they know that this is four away goals for us. And they know they need another goal. Ajaria, Jesus, De Bruyne. Into Obi Ajaria. A little bit of skill. And he flicks it over to Braff. Braff! Oh, I said, what a save by Neuer to deny him his hat trick. What a save by Neuer. Ajari with the corner. That's a good one. Ooh, and Diego Carl's away. Up Meccano is in. Let's even get this to Diaz. Oh, it's gone to Jesus instead. And Neuer picks it up. Good interception, but it falls to Nabry. Good tackle, Ake. It's a foul, but it's a smart foul by Nathan Ake there. Because Sergio Gnabry had beat Tagliapico. And I think he's either going to go through himself or roll Lewandowski in. We'll see it here. Yeah, he's, not, he's nowhere near the ball, Nathan Ake. The only hope is that Lewandowski doesn't put this in the top corner. Lewandowski and it's a save by Edison. Still in. Henderson. Blocked by Tagliafico. Crossing, Pavard. Nabry. How long is this referee going to play? Pavard. Sane. Good save by Edison again. And that is full time, is it? I don't know. Oh, Sane was offside. What a save by Edison again. Diaz. Benesser. And that is full time. A 4 2 win. I wait by me. We played six minutes and four seconds of added time there when there's only three minutes added on. Kevin De Bruyne came on and made the difference along with Jaden Braff. And those two maybe should be in the first team, probably first team starters, especially Braff. I know De Bruyne is already, but Jaden Braff, after that performance, three attempts, two goals, nearly had a hat trick, the young Dutchman. And he looks like he's going to become a superstar for the future of this club. Looking forward to the second leg now, the fans, to bring the two goal home advantage. First game is a big step towards the semi-final. Nagelsmann says, let's concentrate and make sure we are getting to that semi-final. It's not over yet. We've got lads to cover, Grealish. We have them. Who better than Jade and Braff or Ferran Torres? Braff's stunning performance. He makes the headlines. I couldn't have asked for more from Jaden Braff today. Well, he's sorted out his attitude. A youngster who struggled with his attitude in the youth team. But he's strong, committed, skillful. And that's what we want from a player like Jaden Braff on that wing. So we've got Wolves at home next. And then we play Bayern Munich in the second leg. And I think we'll try and rest players in this game against Wolves and Simit. Although, as you can see the table there. They're not too far behind, are they? Liverpool. Liverpool are the ones now challenging us. There'll be two points off as if they win their game, which is not too bad. But we'll see in this game against Wolves, rest the team that we want to play against Bayern Munich in the second leg of the Champions League quarter-final. Well, if I'm honest, I'd like to rest the whole back line there, but we can't due to the fact that the other back line are so tired after playing that game against Bayern Munich. The same with Tagliafico. So this is the side I'm going to go with against Wolves. Steph starts in goal. We're going to give Edison a rest. Laporte, Rodri and Walker, the back three. Kabore at right wing back. Mendy at left wing back. Bernardo Silva and Kangin Lee. In the middle, phone on the right, Avalar up top, and Jaden Braff gets a start in the Premier League after that wonderful performance against Bayern Munich on the left-hand side. The Wolves are having a decent season, but we should be picking up three points here today, although we are playing a lot, much of a weaker side than we usually play. You see their side, they've got Semedo, Sanderson, Domingos Duarte, Saiz, Otto, Kamada, Moutinho, Mane, obviously not the Sadio Mane, Gutron and Podence in their team. I think players such as Podence... And Catrona plays to look out for. Kamara is a very good midfielder as well. Um, Domingos Duarte, a young Portuguese centre-back. Another good signing for Wolves. Very realistic for him to sign a Portuguese player, isn't it? And we've got a less defensive midfield today with Lee and Bernardo in the middle. But hopefully, there'll be enough to beat Wolves today. Won it back again, though. 
Good play. Bernardo, Lee. Back to Bernardo. Great ball. Jaden Braff. Into Kangin Lee. Bernardo. Foden. Foden gets the shot off and Phil Foden makes it 1-0 Manchester City. They're on the counter here. Balls. Catrone. Oh, and they've scored. It's 1-1. One, one. It's Mane. I think it's Carlos Mane, is it? Played in there too easily. And Wolves make it 1-1. One, one. Poor defending. We've got our first choice defence on as well. You'd expect better of them. Lee. Bernardo. Braff. Avalar. And he's gone behind for a corner. Braff's going to swing it in. Not. Oh, he is. Bernardo picks it up. Bernardo Silva with a shot. Deflected away. Going to Bernardo. Bernardo makes it 2-1. Good pass by, I think it was Kangin Lee. In the middle. Into Bernardo Silva. And they're back in front again. It's a poor pass. And that is half time. 2-1 we lead. Then the first half. And we will take a tired Phil Foden off. On comes Liam for the lap for Foden. And Avalar is going to go on this right hand side. Second half underway with the lap now on for Phil Foden. Hopefully he can get a goal in the lap. Great play by Bernardo into the lap and Liam the lap does what Liam the lap does. He scores again. Really has started to hit the ground running, hasn't he? The second half of the season. He wants to be third choice next season. He wants to take over from Jimmy Avalar. The chances are he will be doing. Crossing. It's a chance. Oh, it's bouncing all over like a pinball in the box. Somebody didn't go in. And then it cleared away. Avalar. The lap. Bernardo. Walker. Lee. The lap again. Bernardo Silva. Out wide to Mendy. Crossing to Liam Delap, who's got there just not in time. They will make some subs. Mendy. Very tired. So is Isaka Bore. Bernardo. Delap. What a ball to Ake. We had Braff there if you could have played him in behind. Delap. Kangin Lee. Back to Delap. To a Chimmy Avalar. And Avalar makes it 4 1. Destruction. Of Wolverhampton today. We've been really good going forward, haven't we? 4 1 we lead now. It's a chance, and oh, I can't win it back there. Kangin Lee's played really well in the midfield today, the Korean David Silva. That's who he is. He's the closest thing you'll ever see to David Silva. And that's full time. A 4 1 win over Wolves with a, a less than usual strong side. And that's very good for our title charge. So it's time. Quarter final second leg against Bayern Munich. 4-2 we lead in aggregate, and that's four away goals as well. And hopefully Real Madrid can beat Atletico Madrid, so we don't have to face them in the semis. I'd rather face Real, I think, than Atletico. So this is the side we're going to go with against Bayern Munich in the second leg. Edison starts in goal, a back four, not three or five. We're going to go with the four today. Cancelo, Rodri, Laporte and Tagliafico. Rodri and Laporte, quite tired, so probably Diaz and McCann will have to come at some point, or Kyle Walker even at centre-back. Zakari and De Bruyne are going to hold the midfield, but it's going to be more of a... Zakari holding De Bruyne and Grealish playing as 3 eights, like the old Manchester City used to play under Guardiola with Grealish and De Bruyne. And then Torres on the left, Sterling on the right, and Erling Haaland up top. We've got Jesus, Sajari, Abenasur, Diaz, Upamecano, Walker and Stefan on the bench. A very defensive bench, you could say. But that's due to the defenders being quite tired and probably all three of them will have to come on at some point. So we're back at the Etihad Stadium for the second leg. Manchester City versus... Bayern Munich here at the City of Manchester Stadium, the Etihad Stadium. And there are the two sides. Robert Lewandowski, Muller, Sane, Nabry. We've read them out. You know the, the sides we play. And we've, of course, got Erling Haaland up top today. So it's Lewandowski versus Haaland. Rodri at the back with Laporte. Rodri playing in a back four for the, probably the, one of the first times in his career, I think, at the club. And there is the number 15, the big man, Erling Haaland. And Manchester City versus Bayern Munich, quarter-final second leg. And it's live from the City of Manchester Stadium. He's spinning Tagliafico all over the place. Kimmich, good cross, Edison there. Kimmich, of course, at right back today, not in midfield. De Bruyne, oh, well played to Zakaria. They've got Ferran in all sorts of space, and we're on a good counter-attack here. Ferran. Grealish, oh, down the box, Jack Grealish. That's a penalty. 
He wins quite a few penalties, doesn't he, Jack Grealish? He's so quick on his feet. His feet are quick. He moves the ball so easily. He just glided past Sula there when he brought it into his body. And it's a clear penalty, isn't it? Clear foul by Nicolas Sula in the box. And this could finish by Munich off very early. De Bruyne steps up for it. We'll do what we usually do. De Bruyne always goes in this bottom right-hand corner. De Bruyne with a penalty. And Kevin De Bruyne scores again, the captain. 5-2 we lead by Munich now. And they won the Champions League not too long ago. Only two seasons ago. I don't think they won it last season. I think it was the side that beat us, Atletico, who won the Champions League. But we are on our way to the semi-final, surely, here today. Great finish by De Bruyne into that bottom corner. Simple penalty. Always seems to work. Kevin De Bruyne with another goal, the captain. And we could be on our way to the Champions League semi-final against Real Madrid. Cancelo. Grealish. Sterling. Great play. Holland. Oh, he's finished it past Neuer. That's another mistake by Manuel Neuer. Erling Holland scores. In the quarter final, didn't start the first leg. Great little flick here for Ram across the box. Oh, he's under the foot of Neuer. Manuel Neuer made a few mistakes in that first leg. Um, once the best goalkeeper in the world. I wouldn't say he is anymore. Oh, he should be doing a lot better there, Neuer. Should be doing a lot better. I know he's stretching for a bit, even so. He sort of sneaked under his foot, the Holland goal. And look at that, Manuel Neuer himself, hands on his head. He knows it was his fault. 15 minutes, 2-0 we lead. Another walk in the park, possibly unless we do a Bayern Munich. Bayern Munich with 2-0 up against us pretty early on like this. Good defending Tagliafico. Can't win it though, Busquets. Laporte wins it, brilliantly done. Sterling sends in Ferran. We're in again here. It's Ferran. Sterling. Holland makes it 3-0. It's too easy. This front three is absolutely ridiculous. Manchester City 3. Bayern Munich 0. Well, there's no chance of them taking some extra time now. Even if they were to score four goals. Brilliant by Ferran. Sterling just lays it off. Because he knows the defence are coming across to him. He knows he's got a tight angle against Neuer. And Haaland gets a tap in. And the Norwegian gets another goal. At it. it must be incredible to see how many goals he scored this season. That is his... Only his third goal in the Champions League, in fact, though. I don't think he's played much in the Champions League, has he, for us? Henderson. Ball in behind to Sane. Oh, he's past Rodri. Laporte thinks he can win it. And he does win it. What a tackle, I'm Eric Laporte. I wasn't sure if he had won it then. Grealish. Oh, brilliant ball the outside of the boot. It's like having two Kevin De Bruyne's on this side. And here's Ferran. When he's so quick, Ferran. Back to De Bruyne. Oh, it's a good block by Sula. It's a goal kick. What a block by Nicolas Sula. Good little flick into the midfield again. Seems to be the way to break us down that. When the midfield press, they knock a ball over the midfield in between the midfield and the defence. Oh, Tagliafico beaten too easy by Nabry. Cross in. Sane's there. Leroy Sane. Should be scoring that. Not good enough from the German. Grealish. De Bruyne. Oh, into Haaland. Haaland with a shot. Tries to put it low bottom corner. It's a good save by Neuer. Laporte in there. Headed away by Busquets. Laporte in there again. And I'm Eric Laporte. Makes it 4 0. 8 2 in aggregate. Bayern Munich are being embarrassed by us today. Cross came in from the Bruyne the first time. Headed away by Busquets the second time. Busquets couldn't stop Laporte. Thunderous header. He's our most dangerous player from set pieces, isn't he, Imeric Laporte? And that's his second goal in the Champions League. Manchester City 4, Bayern Munich 0. And that is our time as well. So we're going 4 0 leaders at the break. And that is pretty much buying out the Champions League, surely. They're not coming back from that now. And that man has been a star again, Erling Haaland. Played it long, Busquets again. Over the top. 
Tagliafico gets his head in there and gets it straight back to Edison. Good play by Tagliafico. De Bruyne. Haaland. Grealish. What a ball by Grealish into Sterling. Sterling. Oh, back post. Ferran. Oh, it's blocked. Too many bodies in the way. Haaland and it's blocked by Kimmich. Laporte again. Oh, I tried to knock it to the back post. Uh, an oncoming Zachariah. And Zakaria. Holland, oh, I tried to put one in the bottom corner. It was a nice idea. Rodri's really tired, so he's going to come off for Ruben Dias. But Rodri has been incredible today at centre-back. He really has. Probably one of the best centre-backs in the world. And they bring off Busquets for Tolisso. Zakaria. Holland. oh, inside to Ferran Torres. He's got the run. Holland pulled off. And then give it into... Sterling, oh, he should have scored Raheem. Unselfish of Haaland there, could have got a Champions League hat-trick. Zakaria. Ferran. Zakaria over to Tagliafico. Uh, it's Grealish. Good little ball by Grealish. Into Haaland, oh, what a save by Manuel Neuer. He really struck that, didn't he, Erling Haaland? Ooh, Tagliafico in there against Sane. He's not going to win that one. Muller. Oh, great ball. Oh, good save by Edison. Henderson. Lewandowski. Edison makes another save. Smothers Lewandowski. De Bruyne. He's got Ferran in all that space in that right-hand side. And he's found him. Ferran. Oh, it's Davies again. So good at left-back Alfonso Davies. So quick. Sterling was a mile ahead of him there, but he caught him. Going to serve. Ferran. Oh, tried to clip it in. Back to Ferran. Haaland. Going to serve. Ferran. Haaland! Oh, it's a save again by Neuer. Haaland nearly got his hat trick. Dula. Good switch. Tagliafico in there. Diaz in there against Lewandowski. There is Lewandowski. Oh, he's across the box. What a save, Edison. Is it a corner? He come out quick there, Edison, didn't he? And smothered it once again. Tolisso with a volley at the near post. And it's wide. Henderson, great ball to Sane. Up Meccano, read it all the way. But I didn't stop it. Ball over the top to Tolisso. He's chipped Edison. What a... Well, I was about to say, what a goal. What a finish by Tolisso. And he's actually gone just right next to the post and wide. Everything's gone our way, really, today, hasn't it? Tagliafico wasn't passing to there. He's done it anyway. Up Meccano. Up against Lewandowski. And that's full-time. A 4-0 win at home against Bayern Munich. 8-2 on aggregate. We're into the semi-final against Atletico or Real. I'm thinking it will be Real Madrid due to their win over Atletico in the first leg, but we'll see how it goes and who will be playing next. So it will be Real Madrid, I think, after that 1-1 draw with Atletico. So this is how it looks for the semi-final. We will face Real Madrid in the semi-final and Liverpool will face Paris Saint-Germain. So it could be an all-English final or it could be a Spanish versus French final or an English versus uh, Spanish final. So that's going to end today's episode. We are into the Champions League semi-final against it looks like Real Madrid a massive team Real Madrid to play you know they've won it so many times they're experienced in the Champions League you'd expect them to beat us but we are hoping to turn up with our best side put our best performance and finally make it into the Champions League final and credit to Jaden Braff in that first leg of the Bayern Munich game he came on the youngster and made a massive difference and he's going to be a superstar next season isn't he? so please do the usual like the video subscribe to the channel and we'll see you next time